Hey there, my name is Jordy Christo. I've been using the Intuit Homestead website builder for quite a few years now. Um, I've developed several products, the SEO Extreme video series that helps site builder users, the beginner's video series for site builder users, sitemap tutorial, and I also developed the Homestead Users Marketing Center. Today I want to talk to you about keyword research and advanced techniques that I use to find good keyword phrases for my uh, Homestead Intuit websites. Let's go over to Google because Google knows everything about keyword phrases. I'm going to show you how we can do this. Let's just type a term in here. Let's say we wanted to find something related to cabinets. And Google is going to show us the most popular terms that people um, use related to the word cabinets. You see in this drop-down menu, and I believe they are actually in order, uh, prioritize from the most to the least important keyword phrase that people use. So let's just click on Cabinets Kitchen and do a search. Now the next thing that I like to do is, y is just kind of take a look at the results and pick out some of the keyword phrases we can see right here like um, cabinetry. That's like an expansion of the word cabinets. Um, we've got the word on the first listing here, custom. Um, they're using semi-custom cabinets. So we can start picking out different words that are related to cabinets that other places are using. But what I really like to do is just go to the bottom of the page. And we can see down here these listings Google is showing us again popular search terms that people are using related to cabinets. We see IKEA cabinets, modular cabinets, wood cabinets in the kitchen. Okay, so I would click on one of those phrases and just do more of an expanded keyword research there and take a look at other websites and keyword phrases that they're, they're using. And then I would write down a lot of keyword phrases um, that I would be building upon that have to do with cabinets. Now let me show you another tool that Google has. It's called the Wonder Wheel. We can find this by clicking on Show Options. Now we want to scroll down. And here's the Wonder Wheel right here. Now you can see our search term, Cabinets Kitchen, is uh, in the middle of the Wonder Wheel. And it's showing us related terms to Cabinet Kitchens. Now if I wanted to uh, find out more about modular cabinets in the kitchen, I would click on this link. Now the Wonder Wheel expands that term and gives me even more keyword phrases that are related to modular cabinets in the kitchen. And this little wheel just is like goes on and on into infinity um, and get doing keyword research. So you can get those long tail keyword phrases. Let me take you over to another tool that I use. This website is called Keyword Spy. You can sign up for free. They do have a paid membership that's a lot better. But let's just type in the word cabinets here and see what happens. Or let's do like cabinets.com. Okay, there is a website called cabinets.com. They don't have any paid advertisements, but it's showing that there's 104 organic keywords. So let's take a look at the organic keywords. Now these are top keywords related to cabinets that people are using. Um, I'm sorry, that this particular website, cabinets.com, is focusing on. These are the keyword phrases they're focusing on. So apparently um, they feel like cabinet dimensions is an important phrase. Um, let's see, what else do we got here? Just plain old cabinets. And then it shows the position that they're ranking with the search engines for that particular term. So this is another good place to get some keyword phrases. Now next, let's go over to the AdWords tool. And what you have to do is sign up for a Google account. And when you do that, you'll have a window that looks like this. Click on AdWords.
Once you get in the program, click on Opportunities. And we're going to want to go to the left-hand side of the page. We're going to be looking for a keyword tool. As soon as this is not going to open, it says done. Let me refresh it. Looks like we're going to get it this time. Okay, here we go. Keyword tool down on the left. Okay, now we want to just type our search term in this box. Cabinets. Keyword phrases are very important for your website content. If the keyword phrase is not on your page, chances are you're not going to be found by Google. Okay, now it's showing us all the related, um, or well not all, but a lot of the related keyword phrases. And then it's showing us the search volume that's happening on the internet during the month of October. And um, we had over a million two hundred twenty thousand searches for the term kitchen cabinets. So I could take kitchen cabinets and type that into the search box. Now the keyword tool will expand on that term and give me a lot of related terms to the phrase kitchen cabinets. We have resurfaced kitchen cabinets, unfinished kitchen cabinets. Now if I want to put these in like the most popular um, terms, what I have to do is, is double click here. And this is going to change the window. Now it's listed it from that the most popular terms to the least popular. Actually, that's backwards. From the least popular to the most popular terms. You can see here as I scroll down, we go all the way down to the bottom, and we'll see the most popular term is kitchen. And then, uh, anyway, this is the way you just work through your, your various keyword phrases and you discover what people are actually searching for. And you take these phrases and expand on them. You can go back into Google, uh, the main search, type in these terms and just see what other websites are using. Um, and then you can research those websites by going to the Keyword Spy um, website and entering in the URL of the website that you'd like to research. Okay, so that's all I have for you. Make sure you rate my videos, subscribe to my videos, and get over to homesteadusers.com. Check out homesteadwebsitebuilder.com, and uh, have a great day.